so Steve, if you could only give one piece of advice to our listeners that they could take away that they learned from one of your biggest mistakes in the past, what's maybe the most interesting or whatever you want, want to tell your big mistake story. Oh man. I, I don't know if I have any um, mistakes I can necessarily share lessons from. I can say, uh, I guess I don't really look at anything as a mistake. I look at it as learning opportunities, you know? Um, and I have, if I guess another superpower, I didn't really talk about it. It's the irrational confidence. I just have this idea. I'm just gonna figure it out even if I don't. And so when I got into real estate, this was 2007, and you know, not a great time, especially as a realtor. Um, in 2008, my expenses exceeded my revenue by $50,000, meaning I submitted a 1040 to the IRS of negative $50,000. And what I learned was that I don't have all the answers all the time. And it taught me a little bit of humility. And I also learned the, the value of having the right spouse, you know, um, I went to an event early on in my career, and one thing I noticed was that every person that spoke at the event was happily married to their first wife, with one exception, uh, Lou Olson, who was married to his second wife, but his, work, his first wife had passed away from cancer. So for the most part, everyone is still with the love of their lives. So I watched that, and my observation, my takeaway was the importance of having a great wife. Um, and I wouldn't say it was a lesson, but something I, I observed was, um, man, having a great wife that supports you, there's nothing you can't do. You know, I was a failure, right? I mean, you could say I was a failure in 2008, uh, first couple of years in my uh, real estate business. And even as I failed, what did my wife do? She didn't leave me. She got a second job so that I can chase my dream, you know? So I can't say you know, a specific lesson here other than, you know, find yourself, find yourself a great spouse who will be with you through the good and the bad and Man, take care of her. I couldn't agree with you more. I, my Carol Joy has been with me. We've been dating 37 years, 35 of those 37, we've been married. <laughs> so, <Yeah. laughs> so that is awesome, Steve. Mm -hmm. Thank mm -hmm. you.